love you guys. Mm. Uh, mm. Wow. So uh, Sugar uh, whiskey. Uh, we are so thankful uh, for our sponsors oh, here at Potter Awards. <laughs> I wish I had a... Yeah. Every day. Okay. Um, congrats, guys, on... Talk now, Mike. Don't forget. Foot of the year. Well, I got one here. It's a little more discreet. Oh, it's like uh, it's like in Zoolander when he's got the tiny coffee. I've got the tiny mic. Right. 100%. Uh, best cinematography and best short film. Uh, this is obviously, I think, one of the most beautiful things that has ever happened in skiing. But I also know that it took an insane amount of work. And I'm wondering if you guys could talk a little bit about the effort, the manpower, or woman power, uh, not to be sexist, of what went into this. Hmm. Hmm. Anybody? Yes, Any takers? Exactly. Okay. Who's got the mic? Okay. It was a hard one to uh, really pick up, but you know, to start it off, this took a crew of 14 to even get off the the charts, and uh, it was pretty insane to get 9,000 pounds of gear across international borders and uh, into the backcountry, you know, 70 miles from any closest town, and. Uh, you know, it was crazy, but once <laughs> once everything was once the lights once the lights turned on, <laughs> thank you, Benny. Things were pretty much magical. Yeah, let's talk about the lights. How does this work? Who made them, and um, how did that happen? Uh, we can we get, a, can we get a, a showcase. A little demo <laughs> showcase. Nice. Um, the lights, we'd really, going into the project, we had no idea how it was going to work. And we hired a really cool uh, LED technician named Benny James, who's done a bunch of work. He did a lot of work for the Olympics. And we called him up like a month before the shoot and asked for uh, basically ski outfits covered in LEDs that would perform all over the place and that people could do tricks in and ski big lines. And we needed them in like two weeks. And so... This is the result. Um, they started catching on fire about on the last day of the shoot, which is a good day for that to happen. But we made it through and had a good time. And maybe Pep can talk about riding in yeah, the suit. I was going to ask you, what could you like? How did could you see things? Could you see the snow? What was it? What did it feel like? <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, it's it's just like a regular coat. Just uh, it doesn't have as much mobility, huh. of course. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it, the, the, the real issue, I think, for me was just that you're kind of locked in once you get in it, and uh, you get really hot when you're skinning, and then cool down a lot when you're standing at the top waiting for stuff to get resituated. Um, and then, of course, there were the malfunctions where we'd have to go back to the lodge, and Max would uh, sit there and solder, and we'd drink beer and solder your crotch. Solder, solder, solder. Yeah, <laughs> did that quite a bit. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah. So yeah, it's it was interesting. Uh, now we have the helicopter pilot here. I'm curious oh, what. Nick. I'm sorry. Yeah, Nick. Yeah, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm curious what your first impressions were of this project, and like if you, if you like, yeah, just what you thought about it. From, from the get-go? Uh, I mean, I was like, you guys are fucking nuts, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell are we doing out here? Um, but it was it was so exciting to work on stuff that you know has never been done before and just creating imagery that was just blowing minds and it was so fun. So I was really happy to be there. Nice. How was it uh, flying the helicopter at night in snowy conditions and uh did you ever run into anything <laughs> <laughs> did i uh, there's a tree there's a tree, <laughs> there was a tree. <laughs> um but uh, other than that it was easy no problems <laughs> did, the, did the helicopter have a uh, multi-thousand dollar red camera attached to it oh yeah we had like 50 grand in the air so yeah um <laughs> But, I, you know, once it's up in the air, I don't, I don't think about that kind of thing. It's like, let's get a good shot. So, yeah. I think we got some. Yeah. And you did a hell of a job. Cheers to Nick. And you actually yeah. didn't, yeah. didn't yeah. break yeah. anything. Yeah. That was great. What has been uh, the impact of this project? Like, do you have, is there an up-to-date view count on Afterglow? 
Do we 2. know? 7 yeah, 2.7, but I don't know who's counting. Yeah, no one's <laughs> counting. <laughs> Vimeo? Seven plus <laughs> no. six. We're approaching T Swift. That's all we. <laughs> Watch out, Taylor Swift. Watch Sweet out, Taylor. Grass. We're on your ass. Coming up. We're right here. Uh, all right, well, congrats, guys. Yeah, that's it's probably it. Beautiful film <laughs> um, and something that's never been done before. It's awesome. Cheers. Very cool. Thank Cheers. you very much. Cheers. 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 Yeah. Yeah, boys. Good work.